Hi everyone, this is Steve Stewart. Thanks for joining me on my famous grave tours, where I visit the cemeteries, grave sites, memorials, and final resting places of the people who have touched our lives. They may be gone, but they're not forgotten. Hey everyone, I'm here in downtown Palm Springs. It's uh, still pretty early in the morning, but it's over 100 degrees. There's not a lot of people out on the streets in this uh, weather. It's the middle of summer. But I wanted to uh, come downtown and see, check out uh, Tab Hunter's Star on the uh, Palm Springs Walk of Stars. It's been here for many years, and uh, as you may already know, he died uh, about three days ago, and uh, it's too early to visit his grave or niche or you know wherever he might eventually be interred. So I thought I would just uh, stop by his uh, star and see if maybe someone had uh, placed some flowers. You know, quite often, um, you know, right after someone dies, they do uh, place uh, flowers on their uh, stars. Stars become um, they're a little bit like uh, memorials. You know, until someone has a, uh, a gravesite or a niche. And sometimes, you know, stars never do have a gravesite or a niche. And so it becomes their, uh, their sort of de facto memorial. So I'll take you over so you can uh, see it uh, uh, a little bit uh, closer up. But it's uh, right behind me here. I just realized that I'm here today on what would have been Tab Hunter's 87th birthday. He died just uh, three days ago at the age of 86, just a few days short of his 87th birthday. So happy birthday, Tab Hunter. For those of you who are not really familiar with Tab Hunter, he was one of the biggest Hollywood heartthrobs back in the 1950s and 60s. Tab Hunter was the quintessential blonde athletic, boy next door, and one of the screen's first teen idols. Sadly, he was also gay and had to be in the closet for the majority of his professional life and career. Hunter appeared in more than 40 movies and he even had a half a dozen hit songs, including the number one single, Young Love. Overall, he had a pretty remarkable career and life. I also just recently stopped by his star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. So if you're a fan, you can visit his stars in either Palm Springs or in Hollywood, California. Now I don't know if you can hear me over the sound of the delivery trucks across the street. There's a couple of restaurants and they're having uh, deliveries uh, being made and they're very noisy. And uh, some of the uh, cars uh, going by are very noisy as well. So in a couple of months, I'll check to see if Tab Hunter has a, uh, a gravesite or a niche that I can visit. Okay, so now that my uh, video is just about over, the, that very noisy truck has left, so, uh, you know, that's just the way it always goes. Anyway, what I was uh, starting to say before all that noise is that um, in a couple of months, I'll uh, check to see if, uh, if Tab Hunter has been uh, buried or cremated, and if he has a place I can visit, and if so, I'll definitely visit. Uh, uh, he was a very underrated actor, and... Uh, very popular uh, singer and actor back in the 1950s uh, and 60s. I don't know if you can see that really cool car just going by. We have lots of cool cars down here in Palm Springs. I know I tend to get uh, distracted easily. <laughs> so uh, if you're a fan, please leave a comment down below. And uh, if you have a favorite song or uh, movie, Tab Hunter uh, song or movie, share that as well. So thanks for joining me today on this uh, very brief uh, tour of uh, Tab Hunter's, essentially this is his memorial, one of his memorial stars here in uh, downtown Palm Springs, California. So as always, thanks for joining me today and I'll see you next time.